This Bitcoin signal only flashed twice before, guys. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, guys, wherever you are on this beautiful world. Whenever you're watching this video, welcome to the Bitcoin Family Channel. For the newcomers, my name is Didi. In today's video, I'm going to share a signal that only flashed twice before. This is the third time in the history of Bitcoin that it flashed at this level, guys. And I can tell you, it is shocking to see what happens after that signal flashes. Now, also, of course, talking a little bit about the news, as there is a shift in the exchanges, because one is crawling up slowly, becoming bigger and bigger. And we'll end the video with a short, powerful quote, guys, making it a very short video, guys, like five to 10 minutes, as the internet here, where I am, is like terrible. It's like a 56K modem quality. Like, I don't know if you still remember that. That modem quality. So I need to keep it short but powerful. Let's quickly jump into that first signal news now. As you all know, on the weekly chart, we zoom out, there is a Bollinger Band. And if we look at the Bollinger Band with signal, as you can see here on the chart, bam, that one, you can see that at the moment we are the third lowest time ever around a 20% level. It only flashed at these levels in 2016 after a massive run and in 2023. After that, we saw also a massive run, the, the run from 16K all the way to 70K. Now we are again at a low level of 20%. This Bollinger Band width, you can see it on TradingView, has not been this low many times in the history of Bitcoin. Only two times it was lower. I expect a very bullish move from this level upwards when that Bollinger Band starts to widen again. So when that signal line starts to curl up again. It's a very important band to keep your eyes on when we are in the bull market. Because this band will indicate, hey, we are bottoming out, we are bottoming out. And we have been going sideways for a very long time now, more than 100 days between 58K and 72K. And every time bouncing up and down. That is a sideways movement. That's a re-accumulation phase. People are buying their Bitcoins because they all expect a massive move upwards. And yes, those people are buying each and every dip. Like I've been sharing with you, you should be buying each and every dip. There will be a moment probably the end of August, beginning of September, that Bitcoin will take us again in this massive, massive run to around that 100K level, maybe 94K levels, something like that, before we pull back again. But this signal only flashed this low two times before. I expect, again, a bullish move. If you want to research a little bit, go to TradingView, add that BBW to your chart, and you can analyze it for yourself, guys. Then there is some other news because Crypto.com just became a bigger exchange in volume than Coinbase. They are overtaking Coinbase in volume. The exchange with the most volume out there still is Binance. And the second one, the second one, yes, you can guess it, is Bybit. Bybit is now the second biggest exchange by volume. I've been talking about Bybit since they were like nothing, since they were like on list 150 somewhere. They are now the second largest exchange when it comes to volume. That's why you need to sign up to Bybit right now. They have a special bonus if you use my link to sign up. You can get up to $30,000 as a deposit bonus. But if you sign up at the moment with my link, you can even get an airdrop of $500 and some extra prices. So be sure to sign up through the Bybit link down below this video, guys. If you want to trade completely non-KYC, of course, you can go for Blowfin. But Blowfin is by far as big as Bybit. Pybit is becoming the biggest exchange out there. Why? Because they do what they say and they say what they do. It's an amazing exchange with an amazing team. I've met a lot of people of that team many times and they give a lot of fees back to the community. That is why they are growing that fast. That is why you can get a bonus up to 30,000 US dollar. That is why they do giveaways, etc., etc. Use the link down below, guys. So that's the news for today. Yes, crypto.com also growing overtaking Coinbase, probably because of the spot ETH and the spot BTC and all that stuff, but Crypto.com slowly overtaking Coinbase, also in the United States, guys, and Bybit still the second biggest one. Now, let's jump into the charts to show you exactly what is happening to Bitcoin today. Bam. The first chart for today, guys, is this four-hour chart like you used 
uh, we can see that we fell all the way down to that uh, second support line, that yellow line. We even broke down with two candles and then we came up again above it and finding support again at that 63,865 level. Uh, there is a buy signal flashing, but we need to close candles above that yellow stepping line. The blue line needs to be above the white line. The white line needs to be curling up. That's all good, but there's still a lot of yellow and blue on the bottom. When that turns green, and we close the candle above the yellow stepping line, we can take a trade from that level probably to the top of that Bollinger Band, 67,370 uh, 67, uh, US dollar, guys, that's over there. That's, of course, the top of that Bollinger Band. Uh, so that could be a beautiful trade there on the four hour. Uh, of course, we can zoom in and check the one hour to see what is happening over there. You know, there is still already a buy and a sell, so it's going sideways. We need to wait for that four hour to start flashing and to give a quadruple confirmation if you're trading for our chart. Now, let's quickly jump into some other charts that are very interesting to see again. This chart, guys. On this chart, you can see the large hodlers that they accumulated over 84,000 Bitcoins only in July. This is the highest amount of Bitcoins accumulated since 2014. This was 2014 over there. This was then a very high, 2017. This was also high, 2019. This one was also high, 2022. But this one is the highest since 2014 that we are experiencing today. So these big whales, they are accumulating Bitcoin for a reason. And I'm going to show you what that reason is. That's, that reason is a very simple reason. This is the reason. The reason is that they understand that they, we are copying again the same that we did the other four year cycles. Of course, we have a halving like here in 2020, and after the halving, we go sideways, sometimes 50 days, sometimes 160 days, like this one in 2020, before we take off into this massive green box run all the way up to 70K. Now we did the same again. We have the halving in April 2024. 105 days is where we are at the moment. It can even take to 150 days over there, that green box, and then we will have another huge move to the top in that green box above 100,000 US dollars. That is what these whales understand. These whales understand that we are in the accumulation phase at the moment, just before that massive run into 2025. We are in an accumulation phase at the moment, just before that massive run into 2025, guys. It's simple as that. So aside of that signal that just flashed for the third time, they also understand this four year cycle. That's why they're accumulating. Every time they do the same, check here, the bottom, accumulation. Here, sideways, accumulation. Here, sideways, accumulation. Here, accumulation. Every time when we accumulate in these areas, we take profits because we go up. This is exactly what you should be doing now, accumulating Bitcoin before we go into that massive run up there, guys. I hope you really enjoyed the charts, guys. Yes, indeed, short term, it's an amazing time to trade Bitcoin as we go up and down and up and down. And that's where you take your profits. Midterm, guys, yes, we are nearing that phase, that parabolic phase of Bitcoin. They will take us up to a new all-time high in this bull market, maybe even a bull market top in 2025, guys. So that phase is nearing. We are closing in on that phase. It won't take long anymore before we start to go up from these levels, higher and higher and higher, and you will be regretting that you didn't buy at these levels. In 2025, the top is expected above 100,000 US dollar per Bitcoin, probably between 120 and 140, somewhere in that area is where I see the top happening. Other people are calling for 500,000 US dollar per Bitcoin or 300,000 US dollar per Bitcoin, also all possible. I'm a little bit more bearish and I'm a little bit more realistic when it comes to promising tops to my followers. So for me, 120, to 140 is already a very beautiful top. But it also means that you need to start accumulating Bitcoin today, guys. So please zoom out, don't freak out, look at that bigger picture, don't stress about all those minute charts and try to zoom in at life, try to enjoy every single minute of the day. That is the way you should look at this market as an investor, guys. Now, let's jump into the last part of the video. 
for the last part guys normally i do an inspirational quote i don't have an inspirational quote for today i will just give you an update about our family a very short one and maybe that's also inspirational for you guys uh, my two oldest daughter jolie and juna finally returned home back from their one month holiday we didn't talk openly or publicly about that one month holiday as we didn't want to share too much about their location etc as yes this world is slowly changing into a very crazy world as we can see uh, also in the olympics now what is happening over there all the stuff guys so for us it was like okay let them have a holiday they went for four weeks uh, in total one week to the netherlands and they went three weeks i think to greece Herstonisos. they partied a lot they so they will be waking up late today because you know their whole life reversed in time you know going to bed at 7 a.m in the morning waking up at 12 and maybe doing a nap again at 7 to party again all night long in Gerso. they had a lot of fun but the most important thing was they had a tattoo they had another tattoo. Last year, they came back with a tattoo on the inside of the lip. I don't know if you still remember. It said, fuck it. And I was like, oh my God, who does that? An inside tattoo of your lip? Fuck it. This year, they came back with a special tattoo. This year, they came back and they made me very, very, very happy with their tattoo. So comment down below what you think, what kind of tattoo that is. Let me know in the comments what kind of tattoo Juna and Julie came home with. And yes, Juna and Julie both have the same tattoo and they came home with that as a surprise and I was very happy, very happy, very happy. Let me know down below in the comments what you think, what kind of tattoo it is. And yes, in the weekend, we will share a story or a reel on our Instagram. So sign up to there as well to see that tattoo. Really, 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 really cool guys i don't have any update yet on where we will go as a family in the next one and a half month we will stay here for a couple of days and then we will move on to somewhere we don't know yet if you have any tips uh, where to go uh, just let me know near spain or near portugal something like that just let me know and um, then of course in the end in the winter probably again to asia or south america but we will keep you up to date guys i hope you really enjoyed today's video if you did enjoy the video give it a thumbs up share with your friends and family subscribe to the channel hit the notification bell and leave a comment what do you think that i was still not able to make a short video uh, uh, within five minutes so probably taking a long time to upload this one again thanks for watching i wish you an amazing friday an amazing weekend i will probably start doing one live this weekend if the internet will allow me if not i will continue the normal rhythm again from monday and in the weekends my dutch amas and english amas thanks for watching i wish you an amazing friday bye bye bam